The Truxton Fire Department took just minutes to get to the crash. Assistant Fire Chief Ken Stone says when they arrived, they found total carnage at the scene. The car was destroyed. It was totally destroyed. And there was just, there was bodies everywhere. Stone says the impact of the crash split the minivan in two, crushing it beyond recognition. As for the eight people inside, including four children, Stone says there wasn't much they could do to help since all but one were already dead when they arrived at the scene. You can train and train and train, but you don't get trained for this, you know. And it's always tougher with little kids. Little kids is the worst. Truxton Fire Chief John Perry says he tried to keep some of his less experienced firefighters from seeing the gruesome scene. As for himself and his other veteran firefighters, all of whom have their own families, he says the scene immediately following the crash isn't one they'll soon forget. I didn't get much sleep, I'll tell you. It's, you keep on wondering what you could have done better, you know, but... Uh, the situation, you know, you just had to do with what you could do and the best you could do it. With seven people dead, Chief Perry says this accident is by far the worst the fire department has ever seen. And the tragedy he hopes they never see again. In Truxton, Brandon Roth reporting.